Uh, well, here it is, guys. The end of August, and I have uh, a. Uh, I haven't done race in a while, but I asked Stacy a couple weeks ago, "Hey, I got some races come. There's some races I can do at the end of August. Would you pick one? Pick one out this weekend." August 24th, uh, there's two races that I can do. Would uh, pick out one that you'd like me to do? So there's this race, and I can run a half a marathon on a trail in West Virginia. And then there's this race that I can run through a park in West Virginia and jump around and climb a bunch of obstacles. Which one would you like me to do? She picked the obstacle uh, course one. So. She picked a Spartan race, so I'm going to be doing a Spartan race this weekend. It's the Spartan Beast, which is a half marathon going around a uh, park in southern West Virginia, near a uh, little, little ways past the New River Bridge, and uh, it's 30, 31 obstacles running around, climbing, carrying, pulling, swimming. I get to swim in this. And uh, it's going to be fun. It's going to be tough. Never done a Spartan race before. This will be the first one for me. And I've also uh, uh, never done a race like this. Uh, it's going to be an all-day thing for sure, for me anyway. Um, climbing over some uh, nets, climbing over some walls, doing some uh, uh, carrying uh, some heavy things trying to carry heavy things now I'm doing what they call the open heat and the open heat is a non-competitive uh, it's a non-competitive Spartan race so I can just go at my leisure it's like running a 12 uh, running a half marathon with all the obstacles uh, in the middle of it so it's gonna be fun be interesting <laughs> now ironically though the open heat races um, are not only uh, at your own pace but you can get help now if you're doing like the competitive or age group one age group uh, heats then you can't get any help or you're disqualified or you get penalties and that kind of stuff so with open heats I can have as much help as I want or as I can get I guess and uh, if you have if you go in teams then your teams can your teammates can help you and you know there's gonna be some uh, tall walls that I mean I'll be able to get my legs up over I'm a I'm not a tall man as as a some people would say vertically challenged that's not I'm not really that vertically challenged but I'm not that tall either hey there's a plane flying low now uh, yeah, there's going to be like an 8-foot wall, 6-foot wall, 7-foot wall, 4-foot wall, barbed wire. Hey, I'll put a link at the end of this video to some of the videos that I've been watching so you have an idea of what kind of uh, things I'd have to do during this race. But uh, I'm excited about it. Now, the other race that I was that I was that would have done is it's in the same park except it's the next day and it's just running. It's not obstacle stuff. But... Uh, I'm looking forward to it. Stacy and the kids are looking forward to it. They get what's called a spectator pass and they get to stay there and wait for me and they get to watch some of the obstacles, but not all of them. They get they get to see the beginning and the uh, beginning and the end, I guess. But it's going to be fun. It's going to be exciting. Like I said, it's the first time I've done a Spartan race. I've been wanting to do one for a long time and I actually found a, an old comment on a uh, on my email from uh, two years no, two years ago no anyway it's been a while a few, a few years a comment that I had uh, done or put on somebody else on their race but um, I'll put some links at the end of the video and in the comments below so you can see exactly what a Spartan race is all about but I uh, hope you guys uh, enjoy the video give me some support for Saturday uh, Instagram on uh, 
on this video, whatever. Just uh, send me an email at bivyourrunningdomawell.com. Uh, let me know if you support me and, and all that kind of stuff. And uh, I'll do my best. And hopefully the next video you see will be of the Spartan race. I'm wearing my GoPro on my chest here. Or wherever that is. Uh, I think I'm going to take it with me and strap it there and uh, record the race from there. So I have my hands free to do my stuff. I don't have a helmet, so no helmet today. But anyway, uh, like I said, uh, like, comment, subscribe, drop, uh, like, comment, subscribe, share. <laughs> Remember, it's a great day to go for a run, wherever we may be. And uh, after this weekend, I'll be a Spartan. Thanks for watching, guys.